Hi everyone, I hope you're well. This is Coins Kid. Just going to dive into Bitcoin. Big up the Coins Kid crew. So right now, Bitcoin, um, it is breaking into this pattern again, isn't it? This um, potential horizontal, uh, potential ascending triangle. Sorry, W double bottom pattern. Like it's coiling up, coiling up, looking for the resistance and the support to break out to the upside and get to this red line. Okay. So like I said to you, this red line, if we do start to break out here, we coil up and we do start to come up. Okay. When others are really fearful, expecting something like this continuation. If this is the case. The most important thing at this point is the rejection off that obviously and then the retracement that comes in back down to this low that's the most important thing going forward for bitcoin you know so if you if you're not necessarily looking to buy right now and you're, you're feeling a bit of fomo and you're looking at altcoins breaking out and doing this that and the other they will eventually retrace down to these lows okay and you know i would expect a, a relatively deep retracement back down to this low at some point okay uh, you know to put a confirmation statement in that you are actually coming up right now and you're no longer in these impulsive moves to the downside so like i've always said to you don't buy big green candles because you get big red dildos okay so if you're looking at certain projects like Firo um certain altcoins like um quant and things like that just wait for the retracements to come in before you enter okay don't don't give in to fomo that's what i'm trying to say to you um you always buy the support you know and it feels better as well when you buy the big red, red, red candles and it you look the next day or a couple of weeks it doesn't always happen uh, instantly obviously but you know you're looking it's going back up and you're like oh yeah that was a good good purchase that was never buy big green candles because you get big red dildos you basically get shafted remember that okay i've always said that to you so right now you know for bitcoin it's looking pretty tasty forming a beautiful bottom down here we've not lost this low yet this is the most important low going forward for bitcoin it has to hold going forward okay for so many reasons for so many reasons if it doesn't it's not looking too clever you know and bitcoin could be in trouble i've gone through this with you many times but what we're looking for we're trying to trade the ranges at the moment we're looking for a w double bottom here coil up coil up break out get to that red line okay then it's this retracement that comes in back down to this low that's the most important thing because this could actually still be corrective you could be in some kind of you know abc correction to that red line and then another thrust and impulse move down losing this low down to this red line which is a lot of people's projections you know 14k 10k things like that but i do think if bitcoin starts to do that and loses this low bitcoin and crypto could actually be in a lot of trouble you know going forward it could be in a multi-year bear market going forward as well so this low is really important that we put in last month on the 18th of june and it has to hold so you know at the moment bitcoin's doing everything it needs to you're creating a series of higher lows here this is nice price action to be honest with you you've got kilo resistance like that a lot of people say this is some kind of rising wedge you know you've got a bit of a fake out here just there, a little bit of a bear trap you know where people would have been shorting like crazy a bit of a short squeeze uh, basically and right now you're running to this key resistance which is a 20 you got rejected off it yesterday so it's acting as key resistance between the bull and bears at the moment so i would anticipate some kind of coiling up pattern here some kind of compression price compression just there and then break out to this red line and at that point you might get some compression again holding this yellow line which is 20 and the red line which is your key resistance like i said to you 786 retracement at that point if you start to break out boom you're going to be on that red line minimal okay so you could wait for that you could just wait for that right now or like i said to you yesterday you could have gone long down here like i have i've gone long down there okay because potentially i'm going to be in a potential 42 percent short by the end of the month here for bitcoin if it all goes to plan now worst case scenario is that bitcoin is in some kind of corrective move here abc correction and then we're coming down to one we're coming up in a two potentially to the red line get re rejected again start to come down lose a green line do something like that and then you're having a thrust down and at this point you're not necessarily retracing and then doing something like this you've basically put in a small little abc correction just there and you're looking to roll again okay for bitcoin so it's all about support and resistance isn't it at the minute i'm long my stop loss right now it was on this low but i've changed it to this low i've stepped it up because obviously if you start to do something like that and you come down you can see this is how you do it you, you adjust your stops as you trade okay and you're constantly moving to maximize your profit so right now i'm in a little bit of profit and i'm looking to hold on to this uh, long at the moment you know and again no guarantees because if it does start to roll i get stopped out and take a small loss right now and this is what you do you always keep moving your stops up or down whether you're in a short or a long okay that's basically a little update for bitcoin what do i expect to happen well, what i want to happen is this obviously because i'm in my long but just because i want it to happen doesn't mean it'll happen you know like i said to you this is sort of consolidation in a range right now it could indeed get more ugly where it starts to do this 
Stocks come back down. Everyone thinks, oh shit, it is an, in, an impulsive move to the downside. You trace really deep to that, and then you break out. So this is Bitcoin. That's what it does. It has people's pants down. It did it last year, if you remember, at the, at the end of this correction. Uh, where were we last year? Uh, you know, we came down. Everyone thinks, oh, it's going to zero, going to 20k, and things like that. Because at this point, we, we held this low. We came back up into retracement. We came down. We met the 1272 fib right there. Again, we retraced to this high. We rolled over and we retraced really really deeply to this low at this point you know it's getting really drastic but i said to you open along just there and set your stop loss on that low right because if it breaks you've got a 1618 target and we all rode it together it was a whopping trade i remember this because obviously it was maximum profit it was from there that was your low okay from there all the way up it was to the 1618 which is where we took profit last year so you know all i'm doing is telling you exactly the same scenario as i did last year at the minute if bitcoin does what it did last year from this low okay and you start to come up and you break that red line just there you, your minimum 1618 is 27860 so like i said to you you could have just gone long all here with your stop loss on this low do you understand because at the minute you could still come back retrace like you did last year break up and be on the 1618 and being a monster trade okay so even if bitcoin does start to do this and starts to come down you know the deeper it comes down the more opportunity we're going to get to go long with the stop loss on this low do you understand and then maximize the potential 1618 fib target right there which is an impulsive move to the upside so that's basically bitcoin hope you enjoyed that update stay off stay tuned i'll be back tomorrow with an update on bitcoin thank you for your support okay bye bye